Okay, welcome back to the channel. Another boring video about Green Battery Minerals Inc. And why it is my best stock pick right now. And why I'm buying it right now. Okay, so the reason I'm buying it now is because it's so flat, the chart's flat, there's no hype around it. And I believe in the story of the company, even though it seems the chart no one else does, and I don't blame them because there's not a lot of talk about graphite right now and a shortfall in graphite, but it seems they're not getting the graphite out of the ground and they want to build all these electric cars. So there's going to be a shortfall in the coming years, which will shoot the price up momentarily and people getting out of the ground make money and people about to get out of the ground might be able to raise money to get it out of the ground, etc, etc. Anyway, this company is very low, $6.5 million and they have $3 million in cash and a really good high grade natural graphite resource. So natural graphite goes into the battery, blended with some thin synthetic graphite. So to dumb it down, the difference between natural and synthetic, natural, the earth's done all the, the magic of whatever it does to the graphite to make it graphite. And synthetic, you get this petroleum coke and you heat it up, whatever, to make synthetic graphite, which is normally more consistent because you've made it yourself where the natural can be consistent within the same deposit. Anyway, so synthetic's human-made and natural is Mother Nature makes it. If you didn't know, in the dumbest way possible. Okay, so 6 million, 3 million cash, and you actually, the news comes out in form of video normally. So if you look at their video, it'll tell you more about them than what I'll tell you. So recent video, they just drilled more of their resource, which you knew there was going to be graphite, and they just confirmed it. So, where are we? Try and present this for you. Close that down. So basically, they're a $6 million company. The difference between them and the guys right next door is that they've raised more money, and this is a $60 million company. Six million. The only difference, Mason has raised more money and done more drilling. But they share the same resource. So Green, ba Green Battery Minerals has more growth, in my humble opinion. The grade is huge. These grades, 17% plus. Um, grades in Africa are like 5%, so these guys have to move, some even like lower. These guys have to move way less dirt to get the same amount of graphite, meaning less money so anyway and they got hydro electric all around them so it's going to be clean and green and they want to make that into purified graphite for the battery sector because that's where the growth is in the battery sector although you can sell graphite for other things as well um so you can go through this yourself anyway point is they're high grade they're in Quebec hydroelectricity the neighbors Done all the work, improving it out, etc., etc. Um, yeah, and basically you buy now, and then next year, when there's a graphite shortage, or in the coming years, might be now, might be next year, the year after, year after that. I don't know. But these guys are drilling away, so by that time they'll have a good resource drilled out. Like you know, it's there. Like they've drilled out this bit, and they fit everything. So, um being a stupid person, you'd think they're going to have this basically the same stuff here. Same stuff is going to be here and here. So that's Mason in the blue here. 60 million. And that's uh, Berkwood. So this is... Doesn't show where the graphite EM is like this. Magnetics. So Mason sort of has it more in one spot. Berkwood has it in a few spots. But basically they'll probably have about the same amount in my opinion. Do your own research. And yeah, so you buy this company for six million. The graphite craze comes in the coming years. They go four x just on people revaluing graphite companies, and they've already drilled it out. And who knows? They raise money to get to production, and you got yourself a ten x. I haven't seen any company this cheap with such a good resource um, <clears throat> in a while. In a while. 
So just an example of something company like this. No hype here. You maybe heard about the story here. Thought it was going to work. And hype kicked in. This is another example. They get lithium out of water that's under the ground. Not yet proven technology. So you buy around here and dwindles around because it's already 100 million. Take mine. TSX V GEM. $7 million. So you want to buy low when nothing's, no one's even paying attention to it. Then it gets some news, then traders come in. And that's what you're hoping for in this company. Bear in mind, they do have not just the chart to help them, they have an actual resource. So when they sell this stuff, they get $2,000 a ton, and it costs them $400 a ton to get out of the ground, or something like this. And it's going into the battery of an electric vehicle. So we will need this to get away from petrol. And we will get away from petrol eventually because petrol could run out. That would be very devastating if we don't have electric cars sorted out by then. We can maybe sort them out in 50 years or we can sort them out sooner rather than later. So anyway, you got to put your money somewhere. So why not think about this company and plenty of videos to watch and not sure what else I can say really. A really small company that can <coughs> really multiply its share price on simple news, like the news is coming out, no one's really paying attention. They've hit 28% grade. They're doing the work right now, so who cares? I don't care really, because I'm not selling for at least one year to get my capital gains tax reduction. Because tax is a real thing, if you didn't know. Tax is real. Okay, that's it for me and Green Battery Mills Inc. So do your own research, but look at the grade. Graphite. Rainy Nord. Well, I'll just show you some of the... Um, so here's grade here. Total graphite content or something like that. So that's Mason Graphite, 17%. So they're right next to Mason. They have the same resource. So they're up the top with the grade. Then you got these guys, really shocking grade. Except for these guys, which apparently can get it out of clay, which they don't have to crush it, so they've got a really good operating cost. So that's another thing to look out for. These guys apparently have a good operating cost. Also other things, it's not just grade, it's like these guys are near a capital city, so they don't have to spend heaps of money to get it up and running. Everything's already around there. The grade does come into play. So, and not to mention that Green Battery Mills Inc. is six million dollars. Six million dollars. This company here is like a 60x, even though it's better, better business. Six, they're like three, four hundred million dollars, I think. So a lot of X, you just want double your money and you're happy, pretty much. So. Green Battery Mails Inc. I don't know what more I can say. Are they not good or are they not good? Like $6 million, $3 million in cash, good high-grade resource, better than all its competitors in Quebec, which is not Africa. Um, hydroelectricity near America. So America wants to get some of their own stuff nearby. Tell me what I'm missing. Tell me where I'm wrong. And I can see this, I'll go into detail where I could be wrong. Um, well, not really, because they're only six million. Like, they're not going to go down anymore. They could not get in production. But if they're going to be cost-wise good, there's not much. They should get in production because they're drilling it out right now. So do we need all these? We will need all these projects. So it's a fair chance that Green Battery Mayors Inc. will get into production. And worst thing, they can sell their resource to Mason Graphite, who will probably get into production as well. So the downsides, there's not a lot of downside buying it at $6 million, in my opinion. $40 million, yeah, not good. $6 million, great buy. Any day of the week and twice on Sunday, which is today in Australia. So that's it for me. So Green Battery Mayors Inc., best company I know. Why'd you buy this company with an unproven thing, or better still, Lake Resources?
one billion, two billion dollars, not yet proven there. Technology not yet proven at scale. E three metals, better buy than lake resources, my opinion. But still, one hundred twenty million. They have to raise seven hundred million cash to get into production. Although they can do that in little installments. Um, it's off topic, but anyway, green battery meals Inc. get in production. I think you're looking at hundred to two hundred million dollars. And then they could spend another two hundred million and do the spherinized graphite side of the thing. And only six million, so six million dollars. Only six million. Did I say only six million dollars? Okay, so that's it from me. Green Barrier Meals Inc. Tell me if you find something better that's actually got a proven sort of resource, like you know it's there, they just gotta drill it out more. Tell me a company that's six million dollars got a pretty good resource that you know it's actually going to be there can drill it out high grade compared to all its peers um just tell me one just tell me one oh wait it's comments below thanks for listening and have a great day